Hi there, Ward Central math students. Uh, I have been missing you guys and wanted to touch base with you. Miss Fryer and I have been making videos of math games that you can play at home. And I wanted to share one with you about making 10. Uh, to play this game, you'll need a deck of cards and you can use the ace as a one and the numbers up to nine. If you don't have a deck of cards, you could use Uno cards, or you can even make your own game cards. Uh, just paper and pencil and write the numbers on them. Uh, so, what you'll do is you'll make four rows of four. So, let me show you. All right, so I have four rows of four cards. You'll notice I shuffled them real good before I got started. So, when you're playing with a partner, uh, Whoever's going first will look through the cards to see if they can find a combination to make 10. So I see a three and a seven make 10. And I'm gonna pull those two cards up and keep them for my points. If you'll notice on the cards, there's a rectangle in the middle that has that number of objects in it. So you can actually check to see that you have 10. So I'll put those in my points pile and the person across from me will get their turn and they'll look through the cards and they'll see if they can make 10. So that person might say six and four make 10 and they can check by looking at the rectangle inside theirs. And we'll continue playing and keeping our points in a pile until either there are no more uh, ways to make 10 or we've used all the cards. At that point, we can just count the cards and see who has the most points to win. Now, there's a variation to this game. If you want to play, make nine, make eight, make seven, whatever you want to do, okay? So, um, Ms. Breyer and I are going to be emailing the directions to this game to your family and this video. And let me say that this is optional. This is not something you have to do, but it is a fun game and it will help you practice making 10. If you and your parents enjoy it and want to uh, show us photos or a video of, of you playing the game, we'd love to see that if you want to return it, but you certainly don't have to. Uh, we're missing you so, so very much. And remember, you are loved.